Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is another Match Day Live episode and today Arsenal are away from home taking on West Ham United. So a quick travel to the London Stadium, not too far to travel. Uh, but we're hoping to take the three points home with us. Currently Arsenal sitting in fourth place, uh, but I am recording this obviously before the 3pm kickoffs. Arsenal kick off just after everybody else at 5.30 UK time. So hopefully some of the big teams can drop some points in an Arsenal can hopefully win and gain a couple of places but we'll wait and see see what the other results are i think chelsea and manchester city are the midday game so that'll be an interesting one this will probably be uploaded when this get when that game is already underway so we'll wait and see hopefully as i said also can get in a good performance today get back to winning ways and hopefully a nice victory we did lose in midweek of course against southampton in the efl cup which was a bit of a disappointment so that's why we want to get back to win away straight away keep our confidence up and hopefully go on and win this game uh, so west ham united themselves oh as a speaker west ham united they have just conceded a goal alexis sanchez scoring the first goal for arsenal giving us lead 20 minutes into this game at london stadium and that's a nice start near post finish there from Alexis Sanchez. Goalkeeper didn't stand a chance. But as I was saying, West Ham United, there was a lot of excitement around the club at the start of the season. New stadium and all. It is a fantastic stadium. And they kept hold of Payet as well. And a lot of people thought that they were going to have a good season. But right now, uh, as I record this, they are currently 16th place in the league. And they are without a win in the last four games. So they've got a lot of work to do. Otherwise, they are going to be in a deep relegation battle towards the end of the season. Arsenal though haven't lost in the Premier League since the opening day of the season and it doesn't look like we're going to be losing this one in this game but hopefully we don't lose this one in this afternoon's game either. Half an hour in still leading one goal to nil it is West Ham United though, in possession pushing forward and well played Francis Coughlin coming back winning possession for Arsenal and Arsenal just needs to get this ball forward now. Francis Coughlin, one of my favourite Arsenal players actually, always works hard, always tidies up the midfield and I love it when he does make the starting eleven for the Gunners. We've got ourselves a free kick here so I'll take it and this is a good position actually, I do do pretty well from these positions. Let's see what we can do, it swung in and there we go, as I said we do do pretty well from those kind of free kicks, swinging it in just inside the penalty spot um, and then boom. There's usually a tackle on a midfielder running onto it who can head it into the back of the net. And it is this time Mesut Ozil, the German, who is also a man in form right now for Arsenal. Uh, it's not usually like him to get a, get a goal, but we'll take it. He's usually there assisting, but he's finishing today. Uh, three minutes to go then in this, in this first half as the player just falls there on his arse. And we're leading two goals to nil. It should be game over, but West Ham United with Payet over the ball for this free kick. Always have a chance, always looking dangerous, Payet, always decided to swing it in, and Arsenal, get it away please Sanchez, Monreal plays the ball forward, so a good chance there for the free kick from West Ham, but Dimitri Payet decided to try and swing it over the wall instead of going for the shot, and Arsenal can go on the counter attack, here is Theo Walcott, plays it inside for Ozil, Alexis, Ozil again, he shoots, oh just wider this near post, yeah, should have got that one on target, but it was unlucky. Good attacking play there from Arsenal. It's nice to see that kind of football from the Gunners. And now we're gone into the second half then. Still leading by two goals to nil. West Ham United looking to get themselves back into this match. Cross comes in. And there is Peter Cech. The firm hands of the Arsenal keeper. But he has thrown it out a little bit dangerously here. Now West Ham on the attack once again is Andre Ayew who shoots. And there Peter Cech parrying it out for a West Ham United corner. So an hour played here at the London Stadium. West Ham United just made a change. And Cross comes in. Shots. Well held, but I think we do have a free kick. Also then have a free kick right on the edge of the area, which Peter Cech is going to take. Takes it short. Mustafi. Now just over 10 minutes to play here, and it's still Arsenal who have that two-goal lead. Looking for a third here with Meza Ozil. We just lost out there. And West Ham... I'm going to go on a counter attack, I think. Should have that covered. Well played, Hector Bellerin. Oh no, that was a horrible pass though. And now West Ham have a chance to pull one back. It's Zaza on a tight angle, and he's got it into the back of the net, bottom far corner. Somehow gets it past Peter Cech, and West Ham United, with less than 10 minutes to go, have pulled themselves right back into this game. So it is West Ham United 1, Arsenal 2. And we just need to hold on now, boys. Don't crumble in the last 10 minutes. There is a goal scorer, Zaza for West Ham. And West Ham are on the attack again, looking to equalise late on. 
Skipping past everybody, shot comes in, parried away by Czech and then thumped away towards Iwobi. Now Alexis, possible counter from Arsenal, no. Collins winning it for West Ham, well played. Granite Xhaka doing well there in midfield, winning possession for Arsenal. Now Iwobi skips past the, his marker and now he just needs somebody in the area for the support. Alex Iwobi. Twisting and turning, trying to open up some space for himself. There's a gap on the edge of the area. He finds Walcott. Walcott, though, couldn't do anything about it. And West Ham United win possession. And the counter-attack is on from them. Payet tries to play it forward. But there is Koscielny cleaning it up at the back. Less than two minutes to play here at the London Stadium. Still West Ham United 1, Arsenal 2. Here is Hector Bellerin for the Gunners. Playing their yellow kit today. Oh, nice play. A chance. Ozil, oh, it's just crept wide of the far post. A good chance there. It did take a deflection off the goalkeeper. And as we see from this replay, oh, the slightest of deflections there off the goalkeeper's knee. Goes out for a corner then for Arsenal into the last minute of the game. And crossed in and headed away. Here's Zaza, the goal scorer for West Ham. Are they going to have enough time to go forward? It doesn't matter because there is Hector Bellerin doing his defensive duties pretty well. Poor pass though. And it's very close now to the final whistle. And Arsenal will have another three points in the bag. Go on, ref, blow that whistle. Please blow that whistle before West Ham go on the counter. There it is, Arsenal win. Two goals to one. 